equation of a circle passing through three given points. Okay, let's say we have A, point B and point C. So we're going to find the equation of this circle. Okay, let's look at the example 5. Given that a circle passes through 9, negative 7, negative 3, negative 1 and 6, 2. So we name this as point A, point B and point C. Okay, we're going to start with the point A. So at point A where we have 9, negative 7. So we're going to substitute x equals to 9 and y equals to negative 7 into the general equation which is x squared plus y squared plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equals to 0. So when you substitute x equals to 9, so it will be 9 squared plus negative 7 squared plus 2g 9 plus 2f times negative 7 and then plus c equals to 0. If you simplify this equation, you will have 18g minus 14f plus c equals to negative 130. Let's say this is our first equation here. And then add b for negative 3, negative 1. We're going to do the same thing, substitute negative 3 into the general equation. Then you will have negative 3 squared plus negative 1 squared plus 2g negative 3 plus 2f negative 1 plus c equals to 0. Then you simplify this, then you can get negative 6g minus 2f plus c equals to negative 10. So this is our second equation here and we are going to do the same thing for the third one here at a C where we have a 6, 2. We are going to substitute x equals to 6 and y equals to 2 and simplify until you get the equation of 12g plus 4f plus c equals to negative 40. So this is our third equation. Okay, just now we have three equations. The first equation, second and third one here. And then since this we have a three variables, we're going to solve this uh, simultaneous equation. Okay, we are going to start with first equation minus the second equation. Then you can have 18 minus, minus 60. So you will have 24G minus 12F equals to negative 1, 2, 0. Okay, so we are going to divide this equation with 12 so that we can simplify this equation. So divide by 12, you will have 2g minus f equals to negative 10 and f here equals to 2g plus 10. Okay, when you take the first equation minus with the third equation here, so we are going to have 6g, okay. And then minus 18f equals to negative 90. So substitute uh, the value of f here. f equals to 2g plus 10 into the equation. The equation above here. So then you can have 6g minus 18 times 2g plus 10. And then here equals to negative 90. Then you solve this until you get g equals to negative 3. And then your f here equals to 4. And c here will be equals to negative 20. Okay, so we already got the values of g, f and c. Now since you were asked to find the equation of the circle, so we are going to substitute all these three values here to the general equation of x squared plus y squared plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equals to 0. Okay, so x squared plus y squared plus 2 times negative 3x and then plus 2 times 4y and then here c minus 20 equals to 0. So, the equation of the circle will be x squared plus y squared minus 6x plus 8y minus 20 equals to 0. 
equation of a circle passing through two points with the equation of the diameter given. So, example 6 here, we have the question. Find the equation of a circle passing through the points of 1, 1, 3, 2 and with diameter y minus 3x plus 7 equals to 0. Okay, let's say this is a circle and then we have a point 1, 1 and 3, 2 here and this is a diameter that passing through the center HK. Okay, so since we have the general form of the circle, x squared plus y squared plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equals to 0. So we name the first point here A and this is a point B. So at the point of A, 1, 1. So we're going to substitute x equals to 1 and y equals to 1. So we have 1 squared plus 1 squared plus 2g times 1 plus 2f times 1 plus c equals to 0. Then you will have 2g plus 2f plus c plus 2 equals to 0. Then we're going to substitute the second point into the general equation where we have the point b, 3, 2. So we substitute x equals to 3 and y equals to 2 until you can get the equation of 6g plus 4f plus c plus 13 equals to 0. Okay, since we know that the circle here and then we have a diameter and this the center here lies on the diameter. Okay, so center or negative G negative F here um, must pass us through the diameter. So equation of diameter we have Y minus 3X plus 7 equals to 0. So we're going to substitute the center negative negative g negative f into the equation of diameter okay so we're going to write this as negative f minus 3 times negative g plus 7 equals to 0 or you simplify this you can have f here equals to 7 plus 3g Okay. okay, now we have three equations. Uh, the previous one we have, this is our third equation, okay? So the first equation just now is uh, 2g plus 2f plus c plus 2 equals to 0. And then we have the second equation, 6g plus 4f plus c plus 13 equals to 0. Okay, this is our second equation. So how are we going to solve these three equations simultaneously? We're going to take the first equation here. You minus the second equation. Then you will have negative 4g minus 2f and then minus 11 equals to 0. Okay, so let's say this is our fourth equation. So substitute the third equation into the fourth equation. Okay, so you substitute 3 into 4, then you can have negative 4 g minus 2 times 7 plus 3 g minus 11 equals to 0. And then you solve this until you can get a g equals to negative 5 over 2 and f equals to negative half and c equals to 4. find the equation of the circle, we are going to substitute the value of g, f and c here into the general equation. Okay, So, the equation of circle is x squared plus y squared plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equals to 0 or you simplify this x squared 
plus y squared minus 5x and then minus y plus 4 equals to 0.